Hello, I'm Brian LaBelle here at the Craft Brewers Conference in Minneapolis. I have the pleasure of talking with Brian Hollinger from Two Roads Brewery in Stratford, Connecticut. Thank you very much for joining us today, Brian. It's a pleasure. We're here to talk about you a little bit. How is it that you've come to Craft Brew? This probably isn't your first rodeo here. Uh, I started brewing at a small brewery in Virginia in 1988, uh, working for a German brewmaster there, uh, and started to learn the trade of, of beer making, you know, wearing rubber boots and, and not having a budget, not having a very much money and trying to build things, right? But the more you learn about something, the more you love it. And so uh, you were hooked. Uh, totally, 100%. Right on. Uh, and so it was everything from piping design, pumping design, everything that we could do uh, with duct tape and spit, so to speak, in order to make things work. In addition to the craft of, of making the beer, you were focused on the mechanics of making a brewery work. That's correct. So yeah. what is it that you're doing now for Two Roads? I'm uh, the general manager at Two Roads. General manager, so, so on the operations side of the business there as well. That's correct. So I oversee um, brewing, quality assurance, packaging, uh, shipping logistics, planning, uh, customer, uh, contract customer. Managing relations. expansions and, new, and, and that sort of stuff. That's right. The craft brew industry has grown quite a lot since 1988. Absolutely. Have you been to uh, craft brew yeah. conferences in the past? How, are, how is this one different or what's going on in the industry from well, your perspective? What's really exciting right now is that we're getting through the pandemic of COVID. Mm. And this has been a few years since I've been back to this particular event, the CBC. Yeah. But it's wonderful to see so many people coming back through and engaged in conversations and talking about where we're going to go next. The dynamic of just making, well, originally it was a small lager brewery, now you're making a lot more ales uh, and, and different things that are extreme sort of in, in beer flavor, right. which is wonderful. A lot of innovations we've noticed in that That's regard. correct. So how do we keep strat stretching to, to, to create those innovations, whether it's RTDs or, or whatever it may be? The consumers will let you know. Right? That's right. They <laughs> continue exactly to buy right. and, they, and they appear to appreciate the innovation and, and all the new flavors and things that are there. So we're here at the George Fisher GF Piping Systems booth. We're showing our, uh, our, our Cool Fit product. It's kind of our premier product uh, for, for our cooling applications. And you've had some experience with GF Piping Systems? I, I've had the opportunity to work as a projects engineer um, and uh, install uh, George Fisher Piping at, at Dogfish Head and, and other breweries. Uh, we've used it extensively down at, at Terrapin as well. It, it really, the parts and pieces fit together so well. Uh, and the support that you get from George Fisher is fantastic. I've had a relationship with Dan uh, for uh, the last uh, 15 so years. Dan Stromberg, he yeah. was really the one that helped usher and bring the Cool Fit pre-insulated product from Europe to the United States and really helped develop what's turned into a fantastic application for it in, in, uh, in breweries. Absolutely, and so there's not only just support from Dan, but there's support that George Fisher gives in the training and the execution of how you have to put these things together. Oh, yeah. There's there's the support of a review of your piping and instrumentation uh, work. So you guys are like, oh, you know, you have this wrong pipe size somewhere, or you need to add this element to be more efficient in what's going on. So it's, it's greatly, a, a greatly appreciated. Well, you've certainly hit on a couple of things that, that, uh, that, that, that we like to talk about, and we certainly like to hear, hear from customers who've had experience with it. We help on the front end with design. We help on the front end with installation training for your local people at the brewery or for uh, external contractors if you if you choose to go that route. And then on an ongoing basis, if there's anything that you need, of course, GF Piping Systems is here. Sounds like you've experienced kind of all levels of service, plus got, have seen uh, how the product works. Yeah, uh, and, and had and a great installed. relationship with the company and the folks within the company. Really They're all really that. solid, wonderful people. Brian, thank you so much for stopping with us and, and, and taking the time to talk with us. Really appreciate that, and thanks for your business. Thanks for the invitation. Appreciate it. Very well.